I'm going to show you 15 amazing and actually useful AI tools that you can use for free. And most of them don't even require a sign up. I don't know how long they're going to stay free, so make sure you take advantage of them now. The links are in the description. I'm going to start with a few art and design tools, with the first one being Illusion Diffusion. The cool sounding name pretty much represents a tool itself. What it does is combines images or forms with text to image generation that it creates. So here you can upload your own image or use one of the templates they have right here. I will use this one. And then I will set the illusion strength that will pretty much uh, determine how much this image will impact the generated one. I will set mines to one. Now I'm gonna write my prompt to make it super simple. And of course you can adjust a couple of other settings here, but let's move on and click run. Now that's pretty neat. Okay, I'm not too mad at it. You can definitely see the pattern. You can play around with these example templates here. For example, the swirl would look like this. Now, great. Definitely need to play around a little more to make it look better. Um, but this checkered pattern also might look cool. Let's see. There you go. I like that. That's pretty cool. You can use it to incorporate text, logos, or even faces. It is a lot of fun. Next up is Artbot, which is completely free and a surprisingly good text to image generator. I will create an image of a log cabin in an autumn forest. I'm going to put my prompt right here and down here you can get very detailed with your settings, but I'm just going to go ahead and click create. And these are the results. Look at that. That is stunning. For a free tool, this is mind blowingly good. It can be quite slow and the wait can be very long, but as I said, it is free and it's giving you good results, so why not? You can definitely experiment with specific detailed prompts because as I always say, the more descriptive your prompt is, the better your AI art will become. Next up, we have Playground AI, a versatile tool that is great for anyone who wants to experiment with AI design. Let me quickly create a social media post to show you how cool this is. As you can see, there's plenty of templates to choose from, but I'm going to go with social media. I like this one. Let's go with this one. Next up, I have the option to resize it. So let me make this into a story. And that's how quick and easy that was. And then let's change the color right here. There's so many options to choose from. Let's go with this one. I think that's cool. And there you go. From all the options in the templates, you can get very creative. For example, I created this little angry coffee drinking unicorn, which is a slight reflection of me, but I think it came out really cool. Same goes for this poster that I made. I went from a vertical to a full landscape looking poster. I edited the colors that I wanted, took out the little trees, and it gave me this beauty. I'm impressed. Another cool feature is that you can actually upload your own design and edit it the same way you would the other templates that we just saw. How you can do this is just by clicking here and you can upload your own finished product and then edit it with prompts. I love how many free templates they offer and how easy it is to customize anything. In their free plan, you can create 15 images every three hours. That is quite generous. Related to design, another very helpful tool is called Color Magic. What it does is generate you a whole color palette based on your prompt. All you need to do is describe what color palette you would like to see, and it will generate you several options. Over here you have a couple of settings you can play around with to make the palette more you, and you also get the color codes. This is super useful if you have a brand and you need to create a brand identity or you just want to create a consistent poster or social media posts. Moving on to a few super helpful productivity and document AI tools. And we need to kick things off with Napkin AI. I already talked about this in one of my previous videos about the ultimate productivity AI tools, but I think it is worth mentioning again for it is still completely free and it is so cool and helpful that you won't believe it. We'll kick things off by creating an AI generated article. You can type in your prompt over here if you have any specific topics in mind. I will go with one of the suggested topics. So now it has created us a whole article and this is where truly the magic comes to life. You can add all kinds of little icons and graphics to your article 
like so. But where napkin really shines is by selecting this little lightning bolt next to a paragraph because it will generate you an infographic based on that text alone. I have a couple of options to choose from. I will go with this one. I think that makes the most sense. And I'll adjust some colors, the overall style of the infographic. Besides that, you can choose light or dark mode, take off the background and just play around with it. The cool part is that you can actually download these graphics to then later use them for something else. You would just click on this little download button and just download it. It's that easy. And bam, you have a whole infographic ready to be used for anything. It has never been easier to create graphics for any type of text. This next one is entirely free and will solve all of your file problems. It is called TinyWow and it is a power packed suite of free online utilities all in one place. Remember how every time you would need to convert a file or edit a PDF, you would waste your time searching for free tools that in the end would turn out not to do the work. Well, in TinyWow, you can go from all types of PDF tools to image and video tools, AI writers and file conversions. Another one that is 100% free and packed with so many amazing tools is Script AI. This one can save you a lot of time and money. Check it out. Here on the homepage, you can see all kinds of different things you can do with Script AI. I mean, you have everything. You have script writers for different social media platforms, bio writers, hooks, hashtags. I mean, it has everything. This can really come in handy when I'm feeling down on my creativity. Let me tell you. Let me quickly create a TikTok hook because we all know how those first couple of seconds are important. So I'm going to do an imaginary video of Darwin's theory. It gives me the option to add more description and keywords and even language. That's pretty neat. And here we have our hook ready. It says unlock the secrets of evolution with Darwin's groundbreaking theory that changed the way we view the world. That's pretty powerful. This can totally work as a TikTok hook. If I'm correct, I saw an AI songwriter. I'm intrigued. Let's write a song about one of my favorite things in the world, fat cats. And oh my God, it created me a whole song. Let's see. There's a fat cat in the alley eating all the mice and cheese. He's living large and fancy while we're begging on our knees. I mean, Beyonce, step aside, there's a new sheriff in town. This is so cool. I love this. This tool can not only be used for productivity, but also just to play around, to be creative, to have fun. I love it. Another super helpful document tool, it says it here, your free no nonsense AI document summarizer. Nice and clear. So in Documenter, all you have to do is upload your PDF. You get to choose your summary style, which it offers concise, complete, an outline or a translation. And of course you get to choose the language you want your output in. Now it looks like they have six languages available. Pretty good. And that's it. In seconds, you get your whole document summarized. That is very impressive. Another very straightforward and useful tool is text to speech. You simply put your text right here. I'm going to type in an example. And next, you just get to choose your language, which I will do English United States. You also get to adjust your speed and your pitch as well as the voice. I'm going to go with Eric. Hi, this is your friendly neighborhood AI Explorer, and I'm here to show you amazing free AI tools you didn't know existed. That's pretty cool. Okay. I like that. Now let's try out a female voice. Hi, this is your friendly neighborhood AI explorer. Okay, that's pretty cool. I love that. That's very easy. And I am, however, curious about their languages. I do speak Latvian, so I want to see what this tool can offer me in my native language. Okay, so what it did is give me a default example text in Latvian. So it is not a translation of the text that I put in. Let me just type something in. So now let's take a listen and see if I can do Latvian. Sveiki, mani sauc Kinti. I'm actually very impressed. It actually sounds quite fluid and there's no mistakes. Wow. 
not too shabby for a free tool. As the name suggests, Infographics is an app that lets you create all types of cool infographics, such as you have timelines, lists, mind maps, and charts. What you can also do is create Q&A graphs, family trees, and even SWOT analysis graphs. So there's plenty of ways to visualize your data. The cool part is that you can actually put in your prompt right here and it will AI generate you information needed to make this infographic and it will apply it to the graph. And now you get to edit the look of your infographic. So you can change your aspect ratio and you can edit the text. So you got theme, font style, start text, end text, and so on and so forth. There are many ways you can customize your infographic, but this is such an easy and a quick way to create a whole thing without you breaking a sweat. With the AI feature, you get to make 10 generations a day. The last tool from this productivity section is OmniSets, which is a completely free flashcards tool. You can import your notes or even set a topic and the AI will instantly generate you pairs of terms with definitions. From that, you can make flashcards in different formats like Q&As and filling the blanks. What's really cool is that you can generate quizzes and fun matching games to test your knowledge. Something I really love is their Explore tab, where you can browse through dozens of different subjects and see the flashcards that other people have created and study through them. It is the best study companion. The final section I have left for some fun and creative tools that I love to use from time to time. The first one is Music Effects from Google Labs, and it will let you be your own DJ without having to know how to use these complex audio softwares. It is pretty simple. All you do is enter your text prompt of a certain style, or maybe vibe or mood, or anything that makes you think of a certain type of music, and it will create you two separate songs based on your prompt. You can also use some of these keywords on the bottom to help you out, or you can click on generate to have the AI help you out with your prompt as well. Now we have our two tracks generated. Let's take a quick listen. Okay. Let me try the second one. Oh, I like the second one too. That's so cool. I love this thing. It's so fun. Where it gets really interesting is the DJ mode. This is another really cool way to create music, but this time what you will do is add instruments or sounds, and what you can do is actually adjust how much that particular sound or instrument is going to affect the song. You can just slide these tabs side to side and really adjust the sound of your track. Besides that, you have more customization here on the bottom so you can really get into the nitty gritty of things. And here you go, you are a music mastermind. With this next tool, you can animate your own drawings. It is from Meta and it is an app designed to animate children's drawings or any other character. All you need to do is upload your own character on a white background adjust these frames and then fix the mask. Next step is you need to mark each of these joints and voila, you have a character that is now animated and you get to choose a variety of different cool moves. There you go, like magic. I wish I had this as a kid. Another really fun tool from Google Labs is called Whisk. So with this, you pretty much get to restyle your own images or any other image into different kinds of styles. For example, I will take my own picture and I will make myself into a plushie, because why not? This is literally the cutest thing I have ever seen. Oh my God. And I get to adjust a couple of things here in the prompt. That's really neat, okay. Oh, if this plushie was real, I would totally buy it. <laughs> now let's try to make the same image into a sticker. That could be fun. Oh my God. I can totally see myself taking a picture of my cat and making it into a plushie. That sounds like a good idea. 
And our final really fun app comes again from Google, from their arts and culture experiments. It is called Food Mood, and with it, you would never have to wonder what to cook. It basically combines two cuisines and gives you a full recipe. All you have to determine is what type of dish, how many people, and what cuisines would you be mixing. Let's see what we can get. So I would like a dessert for two people and I will mix, of course, Latvia, dough. And let's do Thailand because I think that could be very fun. And here we go. All right, the Baltic bliss. And even, we even have a picture that does look delicious. We have ingredients, we even have cooking time and steps on how to make this. If I didn't know any better, I'd think this is an actual real recipe. However, it is funny because at the end there, they have a disclaimer. So it pretty much says that this is an AI generated recipe and you should definitely use your best judgment. I mean, yes, but this looks pretty good, so I might actually try it. This definitely can be a very fun way to find out what you're having for lunch or to just get inspired, why not? And there you have it, 15 incredible AI tools that won't cost you a dime. Let me know in the comments which one you like the most and what other tools would you like to see me review next. To stay up to date with all the best and latest AI tools out there, check out skillademia.com. I will see you in the next video.